Okay, welcome. Um, there is, this is a pretty good app. There is one limitation in that you don't actually get to fill stuff in. You'd have to do it in pen and paper and check your work. Neither does it keep tally of how many you get right. But it's um, still a worthwhile exercise for self-driven students. So I'm just going to work out what these numbers should be and then check. So what I'm looking at first is getting the common difference, and, and any number of common differences will do me. So I know that one, two, three, four, five common differences give rise to a rise in five. So the common difference is one. So this here would be minus 12. Now, unfortunately, up to now, yeah, I can't seem to type in there. Nothing I do would allow me to put something in. But this will be minus 12, minus 10, minus 9, minus 8, minus 7, minus 6, and we can check it. Go to a new problem. Okay, we've dropped 20. So you're dropping 4 each time. You're adding 4 this way, minus 5, minus 13, etc. So it has its limitations, but you just might like to study with it. You're jumping forward 240 on each step, back 40, forward 40, 68 to go here, 108 to go here. Yeah, it seems to work fine. Okay, it has its limit limitations on how enjoyable it is to work with. But look, once you've opened it, take out a pen and paper and have a go working them out.